for 2019, everything broke. This broke, that broke, all these cars broke. You got McLarens on McLarens on the streets. But now we don't need them because we have a tow truck. Finally! I know you guys are more excited about this than any new car, right? Yeah, this is sick. Right? Only Ram tow truck right? I've seen in the city. 500. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, I ordered my own tow truck because I'm so sick. What? This is the key to this tow truck? Let's do it. Oh, wow. Yes. Uh, all right. So look, we bought a Dodge Ram 3500 a while ago. Had the trailer. It was okay. Driving in this trailer sucks. It's super slow. It's really hard. I don't like it. Transporting the Bugatti is enclosed. It doesn't look that cool on the road. So I said, look, we've got to step up our game. We've got to get a tow truck. Uh, unfortunately, the name Royalty Towing is already, <laughs> it's already taken, but we're not a towing company. I just wanted to basically get a car, sorry, a truck that had dual purpose. Like when we go to Costco to get water now, right? Like we can just put the water on the pallets bed on pallets. and we can just get all of the pallets one time. So we get one year's worth of water, right? <laughs> so like, I'm just really pumped about that. Uh, um, we also have space for customers. Because occasionally cars break down, we need, you know, seats for them. Uh, I also got uh, the cool new Dodge Ram, right? Which is this is a 2020. Uh, so this has got the new screen in it. This has the new everything, I think. Yes, I mean, yeah. I assume, right? Yeah. So this has the the whole setup right here, which is super sick because. Um, this is uh, is a pretty upgrade. Uh, we've so got. You, uh, you see, you to take a pee break, or? Uh, no, that's probably. This is not my water. That's probably someone else's water. But uh, it actually was brand new, and it was driven here, 2,500 miles by the dealer, and uh, they did a great job. I actually don't remember uh, the. Let's see. It was Dustin. Dustin brought it here from Don Jackson Chrysler Jeep and Dodge and all the other things they sell. But this truck is literally. Perfect for what we've got. I mean, I've got all the creature comforts. I've got everything. I don't know how to the, use a tow truck yet. Yeah, I know. It goes from the other way. That's pretty dope. What? How do you even use a tow truck? You know? I don't know. Get got the all these levers. Tony Where's trip? Tony? Look, we can just push this button right here. Winch in, winch out, down, up. I think we have to push some switches to use it. We got one of these, so we can actually do a dual tow. Where was this yesterday when we pulled that lady out with our Hummer? We could have gone out there and killed it. Got the painted uh, black bed. Man, this thing is nice. Look at our winch. We've got a winch. Look, for 2020, I do not expect to have any cars break down at all now that I got a tow truck. Okay, for 2019, everything broke. This broke, that broke, all these cars broke. You got McLarens on McLarens on the streets. But now we don't need them because we have a tow truck. So not only will this be an unnecessary expense for us because when you buy stuff that you need, Usually, you don't need it anymore. So if you guys get my drift, uh, I'm gonna pull this tow truck in the back. We're gonna clean it. And then uh, maybe we'll just take the tow truck to lunch today. Turns out Tony knows how to use a tow truck. I do. And, um, do you wanna learn how to use the bed first, the winch, what would you like? I just wanna push all the switches. Oh, come on. Every switch, I wanna push it up and down. Okay? Look, Robson's got the lights on it. Yes! All right, for us normal people that have never used a tow truck before, Please explain to me the first step, Tony. I have to double check the controls inside. He doesn't on, know what he's doing. On my, on my old one, you had to like flip this switch to turn the air suspension on. Okay, well this is a 2020, so you gotta have a different kind of switch. This is a nice truck. Regardless of it being a tow truck, this is just a nice truck. And yes. then you get the tow truck. And then if I feel like, if I feel cool, I'm gonna throw yeah, the, cool. like I'm gonna do the, uh, the green seats or something crazy. Like something Cause they make, you know, this is still a Dodge Ram. So they make seat covers for it. So maybe we'll have like some lime green seats made for it. All right, look, Tony, what we got? We got buttons. So we have to I already pushed those they didn't work. Yeah, you have to find the switch to let it all go. Yeah, so we got to find the on switch. Uh, right P there. PTO, Tony? No, maybe um, this? lower work, no, that's, uh, that's upper work, that's box. Just, Should we just push, push them, them all? <laughs> yeah, let's put them all. Oh, oh, I don't think. No, wait, maybe it was that one. I think one. that is. Yeah, yeah, it's the PTO. Yeah. So then, okay. So it all depends on how high the. Uh, oh, there we go. Atwood, lay on the floor. Get the winch. <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm gonna tow Atwood. <laughs> all right. 
All right, we gotta lay on the floor. How are we gonna How are we gonna drag this you up the bed? Damn. Damn. All right, wait. One thing we don't have. Where's our race ramps? Yeah, we're gonna have to steal some from Eddie. Look at this. Sliding all the way down. It's a gloss black bed. Hey, do we have a remote though? I don't know. I don't think so. Oh man. Oh, but look at all this storage. So we can put our race ramps right here, right? Or in there. It's locked. Uh. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Complimentary toe straps. <laughs> oh yeah. This thing is so cool. I can't wait to drive our, I'm gonna drive a tow truck to lunch with the Rolls Royce in the back. Sure. Look how big this the car guy is. That, the guy that drove it said he's never driven a four-door before. He said take bumps way better. So. Well, we have to get a four-door. Yeah. He's, he said it's optioned out more than anything he's ever driven as far as the tow truck. See, I told him. That's why, I, this is the, I got, I got the most luxury tow truck ever. It has 82 auxiliary ports. Okay. Um, Tony, yeah. are you, are you gonna be driving this thing on here or are you gonna no, get a lead Atwood? I thought you were. I'm not, I'm, I'm filming. I'm a cameraman today. Mario's out there doing something. Nope. Yeah. Nope, yep. Oh, we got it. We got it. Look at that smooth bed operation. You good over there? Keep coming, Atwood. Keep coming. Keep coming. About three, two more feet. A little bit more. A little bit more. All right, stop. Woo. Got it. Super close. Stop. <laughs> okay, uh, Tony. Did you put it in park? <laughs> this is the biggest car possible for this tow truck. Well, this, this is the best one to test it with. Right? Low. Okay, right. now what? Stay in it, get your foot up, right? Oh, beautiful. Like beautiful. Beautiful. Perfect. Alright, we'll now we gotta strap it down. Yep. Look at this. It fits everything perfectly. Yeah, okay, so Tony, we have a lot of experience strapping down these cars, but you know who doesn't have a lot of experience? Everyone Everybody else. else. <laughs> Uh, fun fact, my personal Lamborghini Gallardo, the first one we ever bought for royalty, is sitting in the showroom right now uh, at the, uh, what's it called, uh, at the mall store, and it has a huge, like literally huge, like the entire thing right here is all damaged because Jesus, um, well, Jesus loaded it with uh, one of the other guys that worked here, and they didn't strap it down right, hit they the brakes. Strap it at all, yeah. they, well, <laughs> strapping it down at all, strapping it down right, anyways. Hit the brakes, it just went straight into the front of the de thing, destroyed the inside of the trailer and everything. Oh, wait, they so, down the back and then left yeah. the front. Yeah. Uh, anyways, Tony, go through this. We're going to learn how to strap this tow truck. All right. So, with this one, it's going to be a little bit different because the back wheels are so far back. But you have to strap it down. You usually want to strap it as far as you can to keep the support even. But take the chain, which are probably the strongest that you can get. Jesus. These are brand new straps. Yeah. And then this section, so this is what's a little bit different about all the cars that we have. We have different straps, but this goes behind the wheel and you want to get it as center as you can on the wheel to even out, again, the pressure. And then, again, you go down here with the chains. 
Just so it locks in. Feels like you're a tow guy or something. I it was. Houston and I had pretty much the same path to each other. I honestly, we had the same <laughs> damn job. Except he towed for uh, for work and I towed for taking cars. <laughs> I was a re I worked for a repo company. So you want to get these nice and tight. What I used to go by, I used to go by a tire if you get a little bit of deflation. That's the best way to check. And then you got to do them all the way around. Make sure everything's safe and then you're strapped in. All right. So uh, now, now should, that... You should do one. You should, you should yeah. do one at what? <laughs> yeah, because you're going to be towing cars. Sick. All right, cool. Remember that time my McLaren fell off the back of a tow truck? It was some guys like this dude right here who doesn't know how to strap. Are we doing the front? Yeah. Okay, so you see this part, that wood right here. This part right here so goes in the flat. front. So this is gonna go around to the back, but you wanna make sure they're flat and they're not twisted. It's gotta go all the way in the back. There you go, right there. But now it's too far down because it fell. It's gotta stay in the middle. Get it as low as you can. Right here, that yeah. way. You want to go to the force of... Uh, yeah. Okay. Let, it, let it work against each other. Yeah. You see how the ratchet strap is twisted right here? That's a bad thing. So, so we're going to untwist that. There you go. Looks good right there. Yeah. Start tightening it down. Tighten it down. But you, this is another thing. People make a mistake with Make sure it's flat, otherwise it's going to be hard to push it up. Yeah, so it has to, it has once to this is locked. tight, right here, which this could probably go a little bit tighter. So right here, there's a lock. That's good, right there. And then that closes, yeah, and that locks. Make sure it's down. Because it'll just loosen itself back up, and then you're without a strap. All right, now let's test it. drive it with the 7,000 pound Phantom. <laughs> let's go. You know, as much as I love leather and cool colored seats, cloth is just so much more comfortable. Man, they're so nice. Dude, this is such a more comfortable truck than the leather ones. Because I have bad back. I would left the parking yeah. brake on. Yeah, I did. Right? And it's in park? Yep, it's in park. Dude, now, you know how many views I would get if I dropped the Rolls Royce Phantom off the back of my tow truck for the first time? Oh my God. That's a big car. <laughs> he man. said, oh, oh my, my God. God. Dude, this thing's so smooth. Man, this is such a beautiful truck. 7,000 pounds on the back. Yep. You can feel it, like the bumps, like even the, the 3500, yeah. you know, that car was so crappy on the road. Yeah, no, this is this is really nice. Even with the, the weight of the Rolls Royce shifting, it's, yeah. I mean, it's very small, but it makes a big difference when you're towing cars. Especially 7,000 pounds? Yeah. I, we should actually like take it up a mountain. I don't know if we're gonna be able to find a mountain around our office. <laughs> uh, we can find like maybe like a parking garage. California coming soon. The parking garage are really tall. <laughs> There you go. Transition. This is beautiful. Nice. This is beautiful. I see say that, but the voice <laughs> falls off. <laughs> All right, so I can, it's safe to say that we've leveled up as a, as a group to like way higher, all right? So, um, you know, if you guys got your uh, cars broken, just give us a call. I mean, I, I probably won't be able to come pick them up because we live in Vegas, but like, you know, if you see me driving down the street with a brand new car on the back of it, it probably means that Royalty picked up something cool. So this is another way to show off all the new rentals yeah. that we're gonna get, right? No, so that great. 2020 GT500, we just gotta go pick it up. It's gonna be its best friend. Yep, best friend. <laughs> all right, guys, uh, we're gonna end this video. So like us, because we got a tow truck, we do. right? And Mario didn't have any part in filming this video. So maybe a double like for Houston filming the whole thing himself. Job security. Job security, there you go.